So yeah, quick little update on what a post-tropical uh, system is because we get questions about that all the time. Um, a tropical system has a warm core to it. What happens when cold air gets pulled into the middle, it then becomes a normal low pressure system. So just think about the winter time, a nor'easter or a regular low pressure system. That's what the transition has been. It's been from purely a tropical system to a post-tropical system. And in post-tropical system, not only do we have cold fronts attached to it and cold air near the middle, but typically the strongest winds are away from the center. If you remember hurricanes and tropical storms near the center, the eye wall is where we have all the strong winds. I was gonna grab the surface map again just to show you um, what this looks like that is now post-tropical because it's got cold fronts and warm fronts attached to it and it's just a regular low pressure system and the strongest winds and rain are north of the center and not near the center so that's kind of the reason um, we have classified it now as a post-tropical en or basically let's call it a nor'easter that's what it is it's a just a glorified nor'easter moving up the coast so tonight at 11 we'll have a complete wrap up of all the coverage and damage that the 